The balance was broken. Those who answered Chaos's call created an inexhaustible force. And, under vicious attack without relent, the warriors fighting for Cosmos started to fall one by one. The conflict that has continued for eons is now about to end in Chaos's favor. The world has been torn asunder, sinking into a vortex of disorder. As for the few surviving warriors, Tidus, the young man with the heart of an unflinching ace. Traveling in search of his crystal, he spurs on his companions with his cheerful disposition. But his eyes were only on one man's back, his father, Jekt. Now an enemy sided with chaos. Tidus must someday break clear of his father's giant shadow. Okay, we're done here. I guess we got through that somehow. Piece of cake! I'll take down every last one of Chaos's bunch. We're counting on you. Yeah. Every last one but Golbez. Don't worry, I won't finish him off. <laughs> He's no easy adversary. You have family too, don't you? Checked, wasn't it? My old man doesn't count. What? He's going down first. I don't care if he begs for mercy. But he's your own flesh and blood. Are you sure you're... I'm looking forward to it. <sighs> my heart started to race. Just the thought of seeing my old man again. There was no way I could stay calm. Where's Cecil? Do you know where he went? Yeah. Yeah. I was afraid that he'd get mad. After all, I was the one who told Cecil to leave the party. So I made all kinds of excuses, trying to laugh my way out of it. I'm pretty good at that, you know. So in other words, you sent him to go see Golbez? If you want to put it bluntly. Cecil seemed a bit preoccupied with Golbez, you know? So I thought it'd be better for him to go and get some answers instead of wasting time all by himself. Was that... a bad idea? <laughs> no, it's alright. <laughs> but Titus, are you okay? You have family on the enemy's side, too. No need to worry about him. Why not? He is your father, right? And I hate his guts. He's a bully who always treated me like a little kid. I swore I'd beat the lights out of him someday. So, I'm gonna enjoy this. All right. In that case, off we go!
Okay. All clear over here. Huh? Virian! Yoo-hoo! Rosebud! Where are you? Is he lost? Well, well, well. If it isn't Jet's little boy. Dad. What's wrong? I'm standing right here. Come and get me. Or are you so scared that you can't even move? I'm not scared. Silence. Silence. What is it now, your majesty? Your son stands before you driven by a fierce hatred. This does not aid us in our endeavors. Ha! <laughs> what a hassle. What are you guys babbling about? <sighs> he says we can't fight today. Let's save it for later. Wait a minute! Don't bail out on me! Hmm. Do you hate your father? Out of the way! I suggest you direct that aggression towards me. Can you bear such heavy sins? Here it comes! Get going! Hatred alone will never yield the crystal. Your prayers shall be heard by no one. What does that mean? Try making some sense! <laughs> came down to it. My problem wasn't that he got away. The thing that really made me mad was... It just isn't like you. Taking orders like that! Are you okay? I get it now. Like father, like son. What a resemblance. Uh, was it him? Was my old man here? Until just a second ago. We crossed swords, but I let him go. Jekt is yours to defeat. I can't take that from you. Come on. Let's go finish this. Yeah. What's wrong? That guy in gold. The Emperor? He said something to me. Hatred alone will never yield the crystal. I wonder what that means. He uses words only as tools to deceive. All you need to do is stay true to yourself. You want to settle things with your father, don't you? You bet I do. Then hesitate no more. Let's go after Jet. I wasn't hesitating. But still, something didn't feel right. Suddenly, I felt the urge to yell. I've waited for this for so long, so why am I so confused? There he is. Looks like they're arguing. I'm telling you, it's just not my style to sweat the small stuff. So that's your reason for ruining our plans. <laughs> <laughs> I have no more use for you. Fight your son to your heart's content.
Well, there's no one to get in our way now. You're... you're hurt, aren't you? Just a scratch. Can't even feel it. I can still snap you like a twig. I thought you came all the way out here to beat me, kid. Yeah, that's right, I did. I did, but... Well? Not like this. Something's not right. Still scared, huh? If you keep questioning yourself, you won't even get what's yours. It must be hard, fighting against family. No, that's not it. I still want to fight him and beat him. That hasn't changed a bit. But beating him like he is now doesn't feel right. The guy I want to beat... <sighs> Ferian, I'm sorry. But I have to go do this alone. What? I... I have to settle this by myself. <sighs> you guys are all so selfish. Here, take this. I've been saving this potion. You know what to do with it. <laughs> Thanks so much, Ferian. I know I'm being selfish. But... This is my story. So? Have you made up your mind yet? I have. What's the big idea? You taking pity on me? It didn't feel right. Beating you when you're weak. You're a no good, self centered old bastard! But I realized the old man I know is the guy that always wins. The toughest guy in the world. That's who I have to beat! Huh. The skinny little kid talking tough. You better not regret it later. I'll regret it. If I don't fight you! Then let's do this, huh? You're finished! Oh. Just beginning. Then how's this? Look what happens when I don't hold back. Well, now you know that nobody can beat me. You're still just a kid. You've got limitless potential running through your veins. You'll be up on your feet by tomorrow. Where are you going? This isn't over yet. There's no tomorrow for me. Unless I beat you today! Pesky little runt. Who do you take after? Go ask yourself! Let's end this, huh? <laughs> Things. Dad! Oh, God.
Come on. You're fading already? Looks like it. I hate you. I hated you so much. I've always wished you'd be gone. But deep down, what I really wanted was just... your approval. For you to... tell me that I've grown strong. Yeah. Looks like the kid will never grow up. That's not my fault. I can't help it. I'm your son, after all. <laughs> I guess you are. <laughs> hey! Crybaby! You've grown strong. Don't worry. I'll take good care of this. The crystal comes to him after bidding his father farewell. Perhaps proof of the strength that meets even his father's approval. He hurries on with the shining crystal in his hands and the true feelings that were buried in hatred now in his heart. And remembering a dream he had pursued since his youth, about watching his father's back in the setting sun. Cecil. At least I can show you my strength. <laughs> so you would willingly defend a traitor. You and your ignorance shall return to the void.